So this little ring has some potential. Let's see what we can do with it. So upgrade the level of uh, free modifiers by once here. Sure. Yes. Um, remove these two. Uh, I think we want to. Because we really want to get rid of that suffix uh, life per enemy killed. Don't want to remove life. Let's add a prefix. Elemental damage with attacks. That's very nice. Uh, let's add another prefix. No. Upgrade the level of modifier by one tier. Upgraded the elemental damage. Add a suffix. Here we go. Got an accuracy, a low roll. Let's add another suffix. Got all res. It's very nice. We roll the modifiers of a single modifier. So, yes, sure. This ring is uh, not really worth anything. But it is pretty nice. One divine. Oh, oh it's not supposed to be full screen. So, let's move this some more. So, uh, this ring. I mean, we can sell it for, this is 24 days old, so we can disregard that completely. Three days old. Ours has more resistance. Um, yeah, it's pretty good. It doesn't have strength though, which this one does. Um, I think we're gonna go with just trying to sell it for oh let me see here public there we go so I'm gonna go 150k as on this one it's probably gonna sell so let's wait and see so this ring has some potential a lot of nice resists add an influence type sure we got the uh, shaper, it seems, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, prefix five times. Okay. We got lightning damage against shocked enemies, tier one. Upgrade the level of two modifiers by one tier. Hopefully we hit live. Oh, hopefully we hit the uh, fire res here. Oh, we could only hit fire res and life. So yes. Uh, add a prefix, sure. Upgrade the level of two modifiers by one tier. Got the resist again. Reroll modifiers values of prefixes. Reroll the modifier values of suffixes. Upgrade the level of a modifier by one tier. Hopefully, you hit life. We did. Upgrade the level of two modifiers by one tier. Hopefully, you hit life again. Uh, I think we did. Let's see if this ring is worth anything. I'm confused. I'm not sure. It's definitely not worth selling the vines. Um, but it's not worth less. Yeah, it has some pretty nice stuff. Pretty nice stuff. But the life roll being so low is a bit of a problem. Yeah. Let's see what else we can find out here. What if we just do this? One divine? That's without a life roll. That's crafted on it. It has a maximum energy shield roll now. Yeah, I'm not sure how to price this at all. Um, I think we are gonna do one divine and see what happens.
I don't think uh, I'm gonna get spammed for this item, so that's fine. So this item has some potential. Yes, reroll the suffixes. We got a nice cold roll. Let's add a suffix. We got a nice lightning roll. Okay, let's get a nice fire roll then. And we got it. Add some random quality. Physical and chaos, that's too bad. Upgrade the modifier level, uh, upgrade the level of a modifier by one tier. Sure, hopefully we hit the uh, light. We didn't. We don't want to re-roll the suffixes. We're just going to take it. It's a decent belt here. Um, let's see what we can do. Ours is better than this one. It has less life, but it has that... Uh, Oh, it's only 24 armor. <laughs> I thought it was more armor. Okay. Uh, ours is worse then. Yeah, it's definitely worse. Also, this has quality resistance. Very nice. I'm gonna go and say one divine. One divine orb. So these boots look pretty good. Let's see what we can do to them. We want to keep our suffixes. We want to add a prefix here. So we got a flat mana. Flat mana. Flat uh, ES roll. Let's add some percentage ES and we are happy. We got a percentage ES. Very, very nice. We don't want to remove this modifier. So I'm just going to take the boots. Let's see what we can get for these. 100 chaos, two days ago. Let's take a look at them. Yeah, those are better. I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do 40 chaos. 40 chaos. There we go. So maybe this uh, belt could be something. Let's just uh, remove this. Don't want to remove that. Upgrade the life. Nice. Add a prefix. Sure. We got armor. Upgraded uh, the flat ES by one. So here we go. Here we go. The suffix time. We got virus, very nice. Oh, and then we have to reroll this. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the belt. The be belt is like this, is completely worthless, but let's just have a look. So, 15 chaos we can craft on. I'm just gonna do it. We can craft on some. Uh, uh, where we are? Here we are. So for free chaos, I just crafted on some resistance, which is not really going to help much in, um, in the value, but hopefully somebody wants to buy them or buy it and can use it. Hopefully somebody would want to use this. I don't know. So this helmet is pretty nice. It has belt suppression. And 2 tier 3 light of uh, resistance. So, if we can upgrade some modifiers here, and yeah, then it's perfect. It has all the affixes we want. So, upgrade the level of 2 modifiers by 1 tier. Got the fire and the evasion. Upgrade the level of 4 modifiers by 1 tier. We didn't hit the evasion maximum or the spell suppression. Upgrade the level of modifier by 1 tier. Hit the lightning res. Upgrade the level of modifier by one tier. Hit the spell suppression. Don't want to reroll. Upgrade the level of two modifiers by one tier. Reforce the links, sure. Upgrade the level of three modifiers by one tier. And reroll the modifier values of prefixes. Uh, we don't want to do that. So we're just going to take it. This is a pretty decent item. Uh, I pressed everything there. Not sure what's going on. 
so there's nothing like that with uh, spell suppression. Let's just do AD. Oh, no, never mind. 200 again, and then lower the evasion. Yeah. Lower the evasion even more. Lower the evasion a lot. So let's have a look at these. So we have a very nice helmet. It's better than the one that has 100 chaos. It's in line with this one at 160 chaos. So yeah, they're actually pretty identical. It has a bit more life. Um, but besides that, nothing really is different. So we're going to list this for 150 chaos. So this build, if we get a few upgrades, could be nice. Upgrade the level of three modifiers by one tier, sure. Upgrade or add a prefix. We've got life, very nice. I don't think I want to add another prefix, but I am pretty sure it's going to tell us to reroll the suffixes if we don't. So I'm just going to add it, hope for elemental damage. Got flask applied to have increased effect. That's pretty decent. With the level of two modifiers by one tier. Don't want to reroll the prefixes. Upgrade three modifiers. That lightning rest though, tier eight. We roll the life. Upgrade the um, uh, level of a modifier by one tier. So this build is a sad build. It doesn't really have a home. One chaos with the flask effect. I don't think it's worth anything. I'm gonna list it at uh, 20 chaos. Just to see what happens. I mean, the lightning rest is so low, so what can you do? So this belt has some potential. We want to keep our suffixes for sure. Add a prefix. Here comes life. Fla li increased flask life recovery rate. And some quality. Attributes. Prefix. Elemental damage. Upgrade the level of two modifiers by one tier. We upgraded the chaos rest, so it's pretty nice. Get to reroll the prefixes six times. So we're definitely going to do that. And we're gonna do it again. We hit life, maximum energy shield, and elemental damage with attacks. That is very nice. All tier two. Reroll the modifiers values of a single modifier three times, giving the best outcome. So this build is pretty decent. It's a bad base, but it's a pretty decent build. Yeah, there's nothing like this. What if we do 20? It's, I think it's because of this amazing chaos verse, honestly. Yeah. So one divine for a belt with less life, less LE damage, less chaos res, uh, less lightning res, more fire res, and a bit more and two more energy shield. It has more life though because it also it is a leather belt, so it has the prefix, which is nice. I think ours is worth more because of the chaos res. Uh, I think we're gonna go, what, two divines on this one? I think two divines is fine. I uh, really feel like valuing it, but uh, let's just let's just do two divines. I should val it. 